Hey, Matt Scientist. Welcome to another OSTAP analysis. Today, we're going to be talking about finishing from the back. This is Hafa Mendez on Quechino's back from the Barracuda Open. And there's there's this little transition that he does from his double collar as Quechino is trying to defend it right here. Okay, that we're going to talk about. Now, this transition keeps going and Hoffa finishes with a really nice triangle. So I'm just going to let it play out, but this isn't the part that we're going to be focusing on. So bam, he has the triangle. He's going to grab the leg for the finish. Very nice. But we're going to rewind right to here. Okay, so Hoffa has double collar. So this hand's going to be doing most of the choking. This is the support hand. Now what he's going to be trying to do is he's trying to get this right leg of his out around Cachino's arm, out from under his body. And then usually you go over top of the shoulder in this arm and you cross your feet. And you see as Hoffa's trying to get it out right here, Kishinyu keeps driving with his feet. And what he's doing is he's trying to keep his body over top of that leg, trying to get his shoulders all the way onto the other side so that Hoffa can't get his leg out and finish the choke. And Hoffa does just a really simple, beautiful transition right here. Okay, he goes up in a mount. And then Kishinyu has to turtle. And then we see, bam, right here, Hoffa gets that position that I was talking about. The leg is fully over the shoulder, feet crossed, and usually you can finish guys from here most of the time. Okay, but Kishinyo is really resilient, so Hoffa had to switch up. But this simple little transition, like after I saw this, I tried it in training, it paid off immediately. Uh, before, I never had a good response to this. I just always feel like I'm just chasing the guy, he keeps walking over my leg, and we're kind of in this silly stalemate. Again, Kishinyo is driving over that leg. Now, as Hoffa goes into mount, he brings his foot all the way over the shoulder. Uh, I don't think it's a necessity. You could also go knee down over here. So that, regardless, both ways, you end up with both knees down on the ground. Now, as you go into mount, your choking arm, it actually, like, tightens the choke. So the common response is the guy is going to turtle uh, to relieve some of the choking pressure. And as they turtle right here, this is the foot that was originally being blocked by Cachinho. You see it's totally clear to go over that shoulder. And yeah, usually you get the finish right around there. The last thing you just got to be ready for is you're going to be posting on your head as you go mount. See, mount, head is down. And then as Kishinyu turtles, you're still doing quite a bit of head posting. So you definitely got to be used to that on your neck. And that's it. Really simple, great solution from Hoffa Mendez. I hope you guys like this video. For more, please check out my channel. If you want me to do an analysis of one of your matches, get in touch with me. I'll break it down, give you things to work on, and improve your jujitsu. Thanks.